What is up, t shirtpreneurs? It's Sin, and I'm back once again with another video. And if you want to see what I'm doing today, stay tuned. T shirt check. All right, t shirtpreneurs. If y'all was here in the last video, you guys know that your girl got a new embroidery machine. So if you want to see um, how I set everything up, y'all just stay tuned. All right, so right here, here's the embroidery machine right here. Um, it's not set up. I just did the video unboxing and showing you how to do all of that stuff. So what I'm getting ready to do now is go ahead and set everything up. All right, so right here, it comes with this little toolbox. It's supposed to include everything I need to set up. Hey, how you doing? And I'm sorry, y'all. Y'all can hear that it's kind of storming outside. It's storming outside a little bit, y'all. But right here, this is the little toolbox that comes with everything that is needed in here. So the first thing that I am to do is I have to bring this forward and bring this arm forward right here. And then you tighten it back up right there. And to bring this forward, I think you're gonna have to use the tweezers to open that up. I watched so many videos on it, y'all. I should know how to do it because it took a long time for this thing to come. And it was just so many delays. Normally it wouldn't take but about three days, but because of all the delays, so it's like a little thing right here. You have to take that out it's got like a little hole in it right here and you stick this tweezer thing in there and take that out and let me see i think it needs this flat head screwdriver and you take this out yeah i guess once i take this out i can swing this forward Hopefully, maybe I got to take them both out on both sides, I think, maybe. Let me get this thing once again and take this one out. Uh-oh, don't want to lose the little things. All right, now we bring this forward right here. I'm gonna do this other side first cause it's more light. Let me see, I'm gonna move this back out of the way cause I think I should have did that second. Same like this is in the way somehow. I don't know if it's supposed to come out. I don't know. Let me see. I don't know if this is supposed to come out because it looks like this is on here. I don't know, y'all. They don't they don't have the best instructions. This gotta come out. That's gotta come out because yeah, because it had a different thing than that. So I'm gonna I'm gonna just take this out, I guess. I don't know. And it's still going and I ain't ask it to keep going. Cause this is keeping it from going down flat. Like, like it looks like it's supposed to. Okay, yeah, this does come off. This does come off. And this comes off. I don't know if y'all can even see it that good, but. Okay. Yeah, that's better right there. And now, when you bring this forward. Okay, that's it right there. Theirs just look different than the one in the video. 
So they really need to do an updated version of that. All right, so now get this. I'm going to put that back on here. All right, I think we got it from here. Go. Oh, don't lose nothing, girl. Don't lose nothing. Go ahead and put this back on here. All right. Y'all, the next thing is, let me see if I can turn around. Like, I got to do the top. I don't know if y'all can see it because of the camera angle. But basically, I'm putting the top on here. So, go ahead. I wish I had somebody to do this type of things for me, y'all. So, you first got to take the screws out the top of these. And then you got to stick this one down. Is it? They both the same size, I think. No? Yeah, they're the same size. So, you stick one in down the front one. You basically just unscrew the top screws. And you, you have to twist the top holders or stands or whatever you want to call them and screw them in but i forgot one thing i gotta take this and put it back put it back on here i forgot to do that part these little end caps put them back on there okay so we're screwing that in right here you want to make sure you screw these in good let me come over here where y'all can kind of see what it is i'm screwing in but basically just screwing these things in right here That one is pretty tight. Yeah, you just wanna screw them in. Okay, that one stopped. This one stopped pretty much. Okay, so we good right there. So what I'm gonna do now is, where's the top? Okay, right here, this is the top to it. I'm gonna go ahead and install the top, but I'm gonna have to sit y'all down over here. Hopefully y'all can see it. all right so i think it goes like this and then i take the screws and screw it in top all right y'all i'm gonna try to turn this thing more sideways because i'm not sure how much y'all seeing hopefully y'all seeing seeing it pretty good though okay so i'm gonna go ahead take the top of this right here and it's got screw holes in it for these screws that I had to take out. So I'm gonna go ahead and drop them up in there. Let me see. I'm gonna go ahead and start turning that one in a little bit where it'll make it, it should be a little easier to line the second one up. All right, go ahead and line the second one up. And y'all, they actually gave some, some nice tools. Like, they not, these are not just the, the cheap screwdrivers. They are magnetic screwdrivers. So it actually holds on to the screws and stuff like that. Okay, so we got them screwed in right here. Let me make sure this one is tight enough. All right, so the next thing we're going to do um, inside this little toolbox thingy, everything is in here. So we got these little bottom toppers and we got these are the little thread holders. So right here, all we're doing, I'm going to show you with one, all we're doing right here, we're taking these and we are sticking them down off in there. Just like that. I'm gonna do another one for y'all. It's shapes like that. And as you see, that's what it looks like down in there. You gotta jam it in there, like kind of like a little Lego block. And I'm gonna open up these. And then right here, we got the thread holders and we just gonna slide them down like that. Just like that. And like that. 
and we got some on both sides so I'm gonna go ahead and do those um, I think those are pretty self-explanatory I'm gonna go ahead and do those and I'll check back in with y'all once I get done So that's what what everything's looking like right now. And look, you can adjust that and tighten it up once you get it where you want it. Got your power cable goes right there. And you turn it on right here. And what are these? Oh, these are little plug-in thingies. Let me see, that's where you would plug in like an internet, ethernet cable, whatever you want to call it. We're gonna just stick that back in there. That's a USB, and there's like a printer USB right there. So that's what we got right here. And we also has, had a USB right here. And it's supposed to have a little pin right here. I, I gotta make sure I got that little pin. Oh, okay. Okay, here's the stylus right here. So we're gonna go ahead and attach that right up there. And let me see what else is missing. I do have to do all the thread and all that stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and set everything up and then I'm gonna do a separate video because I don't want this to be too long. It's, this is already, already long enough, but I'm gonna do a separate video to show y'all how to do the threading. Cause the video that they did the video that they did kind of sucks because it's just the words at the bottom of the screen and I think a lot of people would find that useful so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, set everything up then I'm gonna do it come back and do a threading video for y'all all right so the next step is going to be installing these little the thread thingies whatever you call them the things that the thread go through thread tubes I guess will be a good name for. The, the way that you install these depends, like you have the shorter ones, the shorter ones are gonna go in the front, that's the only place they're gonna go. The longer ones are gonna go to the back. So I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna place it right here. And these are the shorter two, so just stick them in there. and stick it through there. It's gonna go here. So the ones that are in the front are gonna go on the outside and make sure if I can stick it in there. And make sure I didn't stick the wrong one in there. Okay, goes like that and then like that. Maybe it's easier. If you put if you put it in the front thing first, but I'm gonna go ahead and do this side and then I'll do the other side next. All right, so you wanna make sure that they are the same length. Go ahead and stick this one in here. Then you can put it in here. And we got this one. Actually, are those two the same size? Yeah. All right, so you basically what you have to do is uh, make sure that they are the same size. If they're shorter, that means they go on the other side. So this one is gonna go on this side. It's, you know, you're just choosing one of every size for this size side. So this is what everything is looking like set up 
right here and i'm sorry i got it kind of not in a good place i should have went ahead and ordered that stand when i ordered it but the stand will be in but this is basically it everything set up i'm gonna go ahead and get the uh it's got this huge huge power block y'all see that this big 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 huge huge power block right here right there my bad you just had it was like some little notches on there so we got it right there and i'm gonna go ahead and here's my plug right here go ahead plug it in right there all right so this is everything set up everything is set up everything is set up this is what it's looking like and i'm sorry i kind of got stuff in the way this stuff in the way right here but this is everything set up y'all can kind of see it i'll be doing more videos so y'all be able to see everything yeah so next thing i'm gonna have to do is thread the machine but because this video has taken so long y'all gonna have to see that in the next video but i appreciate y'all watching all right so i decided to move it so y'all could get a better look at everything So this is what this is what it's looking like right here. I need to make this where it's more straight, I think. Yeah. See the screw? Yeah, I think that's better right there. So this is what what it's looking like. I do have a stand for it coming in. Um, you don't necessarily have to have the stand, but I decided I want the stand, but I think I'm gonna put it right there. I don't know. I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with this heat press right here. I don't wanna sell it. I don't know. Maybe this one I may end up selling that one. I don't know. But right now, I do not wanna sell that. And I'm keeping this one. There's no way I'm selling that one. Um, this one right here, I don't know. But I really like this one. It's got a lot of features. It gets hot faster than the other ones. But we're talking about this one right here. So this what we, this what we on right here. So yeah, just to let y'all check it out again, right here. All right, got that thing protected. That's the back side of it right there. All right, so y'all have checked it out. So like I was saying in the next video, we're gonna show you guys how to thread the machine. So if you, if you wanna show support, you guys know what to do. And I'll see y'all in another video. Print Squad out. Mm -hmm.